So here we have liquid nitrogen minus 317 degrees F. So very cold. We're going to heat up a piece of metal that has the metal coat on it. We've already heated this piece of aluminum numerous times. So, so once again, this is a piece of aluminum with metal coat. Yeah. 400 degrees. This is about going to start to show it. Now we're going to put it in minus 317 degrees. So we have almost almost a 900 and some degree delta in just a matter of seconds. And we'll see if this can cause any delamination, cracking, or any other characteristic that, that we would deem not to be good. Once the liquid nitrogen stops boiling, the metal's at the temperature of the liquid nitrogen. Right, so, you can, you so can. it's still boiling, so the temperature is dropping rapidly. Remember, we were at 400 degrees 14. when we put it in. Minus, and it just blanked out. It was like minus 200. So right now, as soon as this reaction stops with the... Uh, minus 11, 18, 19. 59. It's got a little layer of frost on it, but we're not observing, you can see it's frozen, and we're not observing any delamination, we're not observing any nope. blistering, no cracking, no cracking. Uh, let's go ahead and throw it in the vise and bend it. Let's get it good and cold again. So we just took it out of liquid nitrogen after heating it to 400 degrees, freezing it, freezing it again, and then bending it at 100. It's still frosty. It's still well below freezing. 180 degrees. And, and no cracking at all, even nothing. on that hard bend. Yep. There you go. That's cool.